kiwi. And plenty of them. This whole tree is just absolutely loaded with kiwi. I mean, it's... <laughs> I literally have hundreds and hundreds of kiwi, and they're good size this year, you know. They're they're really good size, hey? Look at that, hey? I already picked this one little patch right here. I picked that, and uh, there's the banana leaf. And this is what I ended up with, this bowl of kiwi. Nice, hey? Isn't that wonderful? Yeah, I'm very happy about that. There's some cilantro, bunching onions, garlics, green onions. Somebody cut my green onions. It must have been my friend. And just tons of different herbs and stuff, you know. But here's the kiwi. And it, it's just amazing how big they are this year. I am surprised they're so big. Yeah. They fattened right up at the end there, and uh, and I, I'm going to be eating kiwi right well into January. I, I put them in my crisper, and they store the best in there. If you leave them on the counter in about a week or so, you'll um, you'll have kiwi. Now this one requires a male and a female, and uh, this is the female obviously, and the male is just over behind it, but uh, yeah. And here's the nice fig I made this year. Excuse me, and there we go. So, and here's the kiwi. It's up this fig, you see? It's up this fig. And uh, there's the um, garlic. You can see all the garlic growing in there, and strawberries. And there's the way over there is my uh, greens patches, you see? Yeah. So, uh, just a little update. I was at the hospital for a little bit. And I'm home now. And, uh, yeah. Peace and love. <laughs> it's gonna be the world's smallest watermelon. Yeah. Anyway, peace and love. Peace and love.